Well, I'm live now. How far? Oh. That way. That's what I want to see. Let's see. Pinch to zoom. Yeah, I got a little bit that way. Alrighty, guys. Uh, so on eBay, there was a guy that fixed the IR module, sent it back kind of nice. And popping out the Kershaw Weston once again. If you watched my earlier today live stream, you saw the 70 inch TV unboxing, 70 inch Vizio from Costco for $7.50 with Chromecast. Only thing I found with that TV so far is it does not have Levin TV, which is, or CRTV, which is now Blaze TV. Uh, instead of using duct tape on this, I just kind of taped over it. So if you look back and wonder how we got here, uh, a week ago, I guess, I posted a video live feed on disassembling this. Oh, I got to get the screw for this, but I'm pretty sure, does it go in here and then snap there and then a screw? Be right back. Got to get the screw. Hold on. So I cleverly taped this to my four foot by eight foot whiteboard in my office. This is the cheapy screwdriver that came with my 3D printer. But I had it close by. And kind of an FYI, if you're doing this, and let's see, that lines up one of these two holes. I think both of them, like that. And where is there a screw? There's a screw here. And this has a screw here. Is it a smaller screw? I think it's a smaller screw. No, it's not a smaller screw. Oh, hey, in case anybody's talking to me, watching the liveness of my feed. Uh, let's see, I gotta go to YouTube's. YouTube.com, and if I click channel, it's sunny right here. I'm on the back by the pool, and I think it was supposed to top out at like 62 degrees today. Whoop, live feed. TV IR module replacement going on now. Zero people watching. I guess I'm the first. Am I the first? I am the first. I am the first. Could be only one. What movie is that from? Name the movie. Hmm. What screw goes in there? I have a short screw. I have 
two small sprues. Is it a, wait, I did this already. Yeah, it's not that. I should have three small sprues, two short sprues. And the rest of the screws are identical. It's got to be one of these. So earlier today, I was on YouTube live screwing things in my bedroom. Get it. Get it. That is definitely not fitting. It, it's definitely a machine thread screw. I only have two of these. Is it this one? I don't know. Yeah, it's that one. All right. Two people watching. It's me and one person. There can be only one, and it's whoever's watching right now. What movie is that from? All right, so we got this in. This is going to be held by that screw. I think last time I forgot to put a screw in here, I don't know. But I don't think it really mattered. Oh, oh. Nobody's identifying themselves as watching. It's not like a confessional. Okay, so the three small screws go up here. All right, the cable is mounted, routed correctly. So... That is definitely not going in. So I think the three small screws go here. Armor and axes, hey buddy. That's Chris. What should you be doing? Didn't you jam? Was it last night or you, you jamming tonight? Ooh, ow, ow, frick. I, if I do things and don't concentrate on my posture, I do not stand up correctly. And uh, I injure my back. So after I get this done and hung back on the wall, all right, there's a screw here, screw here. I'm not sure which one it would be. Two screws. Uh, after I get this hung back on the wall, I got to climb up in the attic and run, put a power in for the TV and the master bedroom that I'm going to be hanging on the wall. Whoa. All right. I don't think either of those screws are correct. Yeah, it's definitely a smaller screw. And I think I had one of these left over. And if I had a leftover screw, yeah, that's definitely the right screw. That didn't do too good. Boss Hog! Hey, buddy. Supposed to jam tonight, but trying to get a confirmation that we are. What you doing, Richard? Uh, I'm doing TV stuff today. It's all TV, all day long. Up. Oh. 
the bird is talking. Along with a whole freaking bunch of dogs in the neighborhood. I don't like um, using a screw gun on the way in. Does that sound bad? All right, does a big screw fit here? Not really. Uh, just because you, you have a higher likelihood of stripping the screws. Get, get in the hole. So, Chris, the only thing I noticed, I, I did a little more setup work on the TV, the big Vizio, and it doesn't have uh, Blaze TV, which was formerly CRTV, which was formerly Levin TV. Big Mark Levin fan here. Especially plastic, yes. Yeah, I, I mean, if we were going into, you know, some flared sheet metal or something that was threaded or that's one thing but yeah no it's all plastic and uh i don't know if i'm going to be doing it today or tomorrow but the the back room this is in the corner of the house where it's hanging on the wall it's crazy hard with the truss work and whatever, and they partially sheath some areas. Uh, it, it's going to be like going through a little cave to get in there. So, um, I'm going to wait on going into the back room with this. And let's see, so hopefully I get these stinking screws in. And uh, I'll flip it over. I don't know if I get enough extension cord. I may have enough cord here. But I do have to run and get the remote. And after I get the remote, Uh, now, the TV works, just the IR module I sent out to get fixed. Uh, and there's, looked at videos about it. There's a couple of capacitors and resistors and stuff. And they, <clears throat> uh, they'll go bad over time. So this was a TV my wife wanted mounted on the wall in the guest bedroom. Just in is on the phone. Well, as long as it's people that want to talk to you, like friends, not telemarketers. I, I had like a rude robocall and... Not, not exactly a robocall, not exactly a straight-up AI, but it had recorded portions to it. All right. Are any of these screws? No, they're all the same. So they should be going in. Uh, it was like a PBA uh, recorded with, like, voice prompts, and it just hung up on me. Either that or the guy was reading the script like he said it a million times and was really good at reading the script. No, right, screw it. Breaking out the screw gun. Oh, do I have a number one bit or a number two? I got a number two bit in here. And I have it on the lowest clutch setting. Okay. Ah, that's back of my head. It's back of my head TV. Why does it seem like I have more screws? That's three more across the top. Oh, okay, there's one here, one here. The 
Wireless is strong with this one. Yeah. <laughs> Jay Brennan! Hey, what's up, man? All right, I know where two of these screws go. Can I get it in there? So I got a screw that's needed here. No screw there. That's gotta be it. Okie dokie. Uh, no more screws left around. I am going to flip this over, grab the remote. All right, who here watches Aqua Teen Hunger Force? Okay, and the other thing I'm gonna be doing is updating the firmware on this. There's a USB. Ooh. I am like six inches from me. All right, I'll be right back, get the remote and a little bit of a pigtail. Okay, so how do you tell if a remote's working? Well, if you hold it up and you can see, I don't know if you can see it because it's bright out, but do you see the flash? Yeah, you see the flash here. That's how you can tell if a remote's working. I didn't even need this much cord. In. Oh, I heard the clickeroo. Dun dun dun. No signal. That's good. HDMI one. Alrighty. I think we are in busyness. Pebbles. Sorry. Right, let, let me bring Pebbles out. He can crap on the TV. So here's Pebbles. Come on up. up. What's going on, Bird? Oh, you a little nervous? He's a little nervous. There he is! It's the bird! You good boy? You good boy. You good birdie. He's a little nervous. I feel him trembling a little. You good boy. You good boy? Good boy, good boy. All righty. Uh, let's see. Let me hang this on the wall. If you guys want to stick with me, I am going to hang this on the wall. Well, 
I don't know that he's camera shy. I think he's just a little nervous. There's a whole bunch of stuff. There's, you know, like an arm with a cam my phone hanging above him. Ooh, the head rubbing it. How the heck could this be like boofering? All right, uh, so I am gonna grab my tripod rig. And let's see, am I sideways? It's telling me to rotate the device. Uh oh, what didn't I think? Is there a wall I didn't hit? There might be a wall I haven't hit. All right, so let's see if I put it this way. And let's see if there's no friction and tension. Will it stay? No, it's not going to stay. Rotate. That's going to hang like this. And now you get to see who really is the master of live video. Uh -oh. I don't know what you see. What the heck do you guys see? You see a wall. My stream. I got seven people watching. Dude, you guys need to get a life. All right, so the TV is going to go there. Let's see what it does. I got to lock the tripod in. Let's see. Locking, rotating, whatever. All right, so let me grab the TV. All right, guys, I kind of lied to you. I didn't put the mounting bracket on the back. I got to get that into the mounting bracket and so Dude, is, is that just like NASCAR? Are you waiting for me to drop the TV like people that watch NASCAR are waiting for a wreck? Okay, there is an arrow up. Which points to the TV's up. And, and sorry I'm not moving the camera around, just... Uh, that is a piece of EMT. Extruded metal tubing, electrical tubing. That I just cut on my... Miter saw. I printed a socket that it fits in my tripod and I printed a ball mount and a ball whatever whatever for to hook stuff up to it. Okie doke. Alrighty, so this has a hook on it, and if I don't trip over the cord, did it make it? I can't tell! I'm live! Oh, I want that camera, I want that camera. Dude, I don't know what's... Oh, I missed all the fun. Let's see if I slide it over. And then it's not strong enough that way. Alrighty guys, uh, I got it on the wall here. And 
So what am I going to plug in next? Uh, actually, believe it or not, this is a Roku right here. Roku streaming stick. So I am going to plug it into, I think, right here. Let's see if I turn it out. Will you be able to see a little better? I believe, is that HDMI 1? And there's actually power right here. And I'm going to be doing a firmware update with that. And my wife would lose her mind. I know there was a way I got that to hide. Is that HDMI 1? Maybe that's not HDMI 1. That's it. HDMI 1 is on the back. All right, you think it goes left to right or right to left? Which way? Roku, okay. That's the way it goes. All righty, so we got the Roku working on this. My wife's gonna lose her mind if I don't get that wire snaked through the wall. Cool thing about YouTube TV is you don't need an ethernet connection, you don't need a cable TV connection. You're freaking wireless, period. Pretty stink cool. Got two people's watching. Uh, I'm gonna call it done from here. Yeah, let's just see. Let's go for a walk around the house. Oh, that's my hand. That's not my hand. So uh, you can say hi to Pebbles. Hi, Pebbles. Pebbles, you camera shy? What's going on, man? What's going on, Bert? What's going on? Hmm? What are you doing? He's He's got a ladder, so it's easier to move around. What are you doing? Yeah, you guys didn't want to see that. Uh, did you get my email on flying right? Yeah, yeah, I replied to your email, Knife. Uh-oh. Yeah, I replied to your email. Uh, my Gmail account is Richard Hughes two six zero. What's going on, man? He he's a little feisty. Is my screen uh, is that dirty? I put a new case. It's got plastic over the phone uh, over the lens. I dropped this. Yeah, yeah, I did reply. I'll, I'll verify it. I'll check. Anyhow, thanks for the three thumbs up. I'm gonna do a firmware upgrade on that TV, and then I'm gonna be crawling around in the rafters way up above there. The unfortunate part is, I'll take you for a walk around, is um, we got the Christmas tree. Oh, okay, wait, let's see. Okay, Google, Christmas lights on. Sorry, I don't understand. What? Come on, oh, that's my phone. I'm reaching for my phone. Okay, Google, Christmas light on. Hmm. Okay, Google. Christmas on? Christmas day, so please say this on your phone perfectly in your ear. No. Okay, Google. Christmas lights on? Sorry, Alright, that's not happening. So, uh, don't fall through the ceiling. Yes, that would totally suck. Because uh, the the truss work, it's like 24 inches on center. So uh, Hughes Compound Southern Command. That room, let's see, where am I pointing? Yeah, is in the back here. And you can see as the different roof lines come together, there's some plywood that goes back along that roof line and kind of blocks access to that area where that room is that we were just in. And... Uh, you, you got to crawl through like a super small opening up there. Anyhow, what I'm doing for the uh, TV in the master bedroom setup, the wall mount and uh, the recessed, I'm going to sit down for a minute here. The recessed uh, it's like mid 60s I think right now, so it's not real hot. Uh, it's actually kind of cool. 
I think Christmas Day is supposed to be like 77. Uh, so, yeah, it's... Good thing I lost some weight, yeah. Yes, indeed. And in case you haven't been watching me, I've lost 20 pounds on Nutrisystems. I don't know how long. I'm probably six weeks into it. Uh, so, been been losing weight with that. Frick, and I was, my wife hates the Tiki Hut and wants it taken down. Like, nobody uses it for anything. Uh, but I... You're in Ohio right now. Well, not me. Does this look like Ohio to you? Do the palm trees give it away? So the Tiki Hut, I had re-roofed like three years ago, uh, but it, it needs patching up right now, which is kind of rough. So uh, not really willing to spend money on that to get that all patched up. Got a whole bunch of other things to do. You know, my wife gave got a plant. Somebody gave her a plant, and she asked me to. She doesn't do. Are not looking so good. The like the same Christmas cactus, or you know, my great great grandmother had this Christmas cactus. It's been in the family forever. That is a semaphore cactus. That was a little bit of one of these. And same thing with that. So I'm going to break some more off and plant them. Uh, that's indigenous to the Florida Keys. And I got that when I was doing a hurricane cleanup there with a uh, local church. And another cactus a buddy gave me. So that that was, he just gave me the lower ear. You know, it was an ear like this, or a little wider, you know. But he just... Uh, Armin Axe is near Tyvan. I guess he is. Ready, guys? Um, ooh, I could like, hang out in the chaise lounge here. It might be nice on my back. Maybe not. I gotta lay down for two and a half hours away. Crikey! Ooh, it looks really blue when I was like right about. Here. Was it here? Oh my gosh! Does the sky look that beautiful? Kind of does. Alrighty, guys, uh, I am going to sign off. So, in case you do not hear any more YouTubiness from me. Merry Christmas, Happy New Year's, be safe out there. I probably need a shave. Well, I'm going to be crawling through the rafter space. Like up, up there. All through there. So, uh, I'll see you guys later. Be good. And uh, hopefully I don't fall through the ceiling on my house. Take care, guys.